Hello everyone, in this video we are going to learn about how you can create your own English dictionary app in MIT App Inventor. So before entering the video, make sure you click the red color subscribe button and the bell icon and set it to all. So let's back to the MIT App Inventor and click the start new project and in this project name is going to be the dictionary app. Dictionary app. Then you need to click this OK button. So then it will be creating and it will redirect you to the this designing page and i'm going to save this mobile size to the tablets so this I, I don't want to see the screen one name label so this uh, for that i need to disable this checkbox because of that i can't able to see that so then i need to drag and drop this label here and i need to keep this screens uh, horizontal align horizontal is going to be the center and the align vertical is going to be the center and this text input uh, sorry this labels text is going to be this uh, text is going to be dictionary app dictionary app so then this uh, the font font is going to be the bold and it is going to be the italic on this font size is going to be the 25 because of that it will be very increased so then what I need to do means I want to uh, go to this layout name section here I can get this horizontal arrangement I want to drag and drop after this label and this horizontal arrangement which is going to be the fill parent and set it to OK. So then it is going to be a, a, a line horizontal is going to be the center. So then to, uh, instead of top, you are going to set a center. So then what I need to do means I'm going to drag and drop this a uh, text box here, then one button here. So this text box, a hint is going to be search dictionary. So then three dots. So here, this button's value is going to be search. So then this button's text is going to be, text color is going to be, I'm going to say, select this uh, text button. Uh, so then I need to select this text color is going to be the white and this background color is going to be the black. Also, this width is going to be the 100 in size, 100 pixels. So then, and the shape is going to be rounded so then what i need to do next means i want to set this horizontal arrangements a uh, background color is going to be the known so then what i need to do means i want to drag and drop one list view here so then with this going to be the fill parent and this height is going to be a fill parent too so then this background color is going to be the known and this text color is going to be the white so this is the overall so not our uh, text color is going to be the dark gray here. So then I want to go to a uh, one a uh, website. So I will give this website's link on the description. So here we are going to get this AIX file. So after downloading this AIX file, so then I need to. So once you have downloaded this extension, then you need to go to this extension in our MIT app inventor, then drag and drop on this extension. So you need to take this import extension. And you need to drag and drop on this choose files so then click the input button because of that you know, it will input so please wait uh it will extension is upgraded okay so then i need to drag and drop it here so then what i need to do means i'm going to the block section now so then what i need to do here means so once this button was clicked button one was click uh, search button then what i need to do means so whenever this button one was clicked so that time user is going to search for this uh for that inputted value for that what i need to do means i need to get the uh, drag and drop this get meaning so here the word is going to be this uh user's text input once box so this uh i'm going to drag and drop this text input once it is going to be the text and the source language is going to be the uh, drag and drop this empty text and type as en which means english so then what I need to do means once the user was got the value for that uh, get, I need to get this once meaning spread, uh, stripped. So then what I need to do means I need to display it on the uh, list viewer. So as a element. So here what I'm going to do means here. So here's a list view once. So here we are going to set this elements so elements is going to be the we are going to split the elements uh, split the value from the meaning so this text is going to be the value name the variable and at, we are going to break it every time 
so if you remember uh, we have used this uh, this kind of b or tag is used in the html okay it's asked me some questions so let me use this okay so then i'm going to this dictionary app again so here continue so go to the blocks yes uh, here's this uh, views uh, elements is going to be this text a text split we are going to split it uh, and the text is going to be the this value so this value named variable and at we are going to uh, we are going to use this beyond tag which is break tag so we will be using this on the html hypertext markup language so this is the overall uh, app that we have developed so thank you for watching this video if you like the video please uh, click the regular subscribe button and the bell icon please support us by clicking the like button if you like it so also like this i will publish more videos please don't forget to watch everything so thank you let's meet on the next video